in three, two, one, go! Here we are in finals match number two at the Chicago Robotics Invitational. We've got five of six robots moving around the field. Let's see if Taco Bots will get to do it. Yes, they will. Pixelated going up for another game piece, not quite placing it down. Their Reliance Spider of Creek Robotics placing, but just bouncing off that collaborative hub. But they've got another one up there just as fast. Pixelated with another, the top of the red, not quite placing it though. Taco Bots getting in position. We've still got a few seconds left of the autonomous period. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. Here we are in the teleoperated period as all six robots are looking for where to go. Are we going to see that same strategy we saw in other matches? Are we going to see a six offensive robot match? Who's to say? We've got three pieces of freight in the top of the blue alliance hub, two in the top of the red alliance hub, and we see one of the shared hubs go flying courtesy of Upper Creek Robotics. We'll see what happens with that. The rounds will tell us after this match is over. The Red Alliance has taken control of the Collaborative Hub, tipped towards them. The Blue Alliance really stacking up, but it looks like 11.099, Taco Bots, they might be beached up on top of that barrier. Maybe that's defense, we don't know. Up the Creek looking for their next game piece. It looks like that middle hub is, or the uh, shared hub is tilted towards Blue. It looks like it's now beached on top of the barrier as well. Over on the Blue Lions, 10-100, placing more of those freight on top of the Blue Hub, while the Red Lions continue their strong lead for the Collaborative Hub. Pixelated is trying to get their way around Taco Bot. They seem to be wedging their shoot. Nope, they just barely sneak by with their Alliance Rider up a creek going for the Red Alliance Hub as well. We have about 45 seconds left in this match as the Jared Hub seems to be fully out of commission with that 30 second mark. Here we go. The last 30 seconds of this match is our end game, where alliances can take their alliance cap pieces and place them on the top of the red or blue alliance hub for additional points. We're trying to get those last few pieces of freight into those red and blue alliance hubs and get those ducks onto the field in the corners and then park before the time expires to one and time.